Hello, I'm the Game Beaver, and today this episode is brought to you by an awesome collaboration between myself and a Jurassic Collectible who has got himself uh, some. Oh, they're Brawlosaurs, right? Yeah, they're Brawlosaurs! And uh, he has made a video uh, reviewing them as a, like a toy, is what they come as. Uh, so if you want to go check that out, uh, there is a link in the description below, or maybe something popped up right now. I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but anyway, um, I'm going to take over. You may have watched the video came from there, but maybe if you've watched this one, go back to there. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to be reviewing their in-game, so what they're like in-game. Um, so I am going to spend 247 bucks. Oh, that's a lot. Two do the uh, battle stage infinite so we can win a pack at the same time as well as showcasing one of these so today's episode we're going to be showcasing i think it's the t-rex so i'm going to enter and then i need to go scan now so you click scan now and then you hold the beautiful thing up to whatever it is but i uh, i'm not going to show you it because i'm going to show you sonic instead because i'm going to scan it off screen because these sort of things there's been a lot of um times people have got them and then it's turned out they've already been scanned. So, and I think once you scan it once, that's it. They can't be used again. So uh, I think if you have a complaint on that, go to Ludia. So I'll join you in a second. There we go. That was quick. <laughs> Brawlosaur activated Tyrannosaurus Rex. This Brawlosaur will enter your team and is ready for action. It is, in fact, a level one. Um, oh my. <laughs> Well, uh, I was, where I am at the game is, I'm level 50, I'm pretty high. Uh, so this Brawlosaur, at the stage I'm at, isn't usable for uh, infinite packs. But, don't let that worry you, uh, you can go into a challenge and scan it again. So I will do it in a challenge, and this way it will average out to what you use. So I will do that in uh, right now. And there we go, so um, we need three other creatures now. They, these Brawlosaurs cannot be placed in park, but they have their own unique colors, they're all level 1, and I'm pretty sure this is going to be a pretty cool way for uh, the game to have certain creatures in like Blue or Charlie, Delta, and Echo. That would be pretty awesome to have them as like a little figure and in the game. Uh, so we're going to have to team up. It is... Oh, I'm trying to see... How good it is. I th yeah, I think it's better than a regular uh, level 1 T-Rex, definitely. So, if we look at a level 1... Oh, yeah, it is. Like, I think it might be the same, actually. So, what we're going to do is place him in first. Actually, no, we'll place him in last. That's what we'll do. We'll place him in last. So, I'll take him out for a second. We'll place in really, really weak dinos. And I mean weakest of the weak. This is what tactic works for me. So, we're going to put in two Tijongasauruses. <laughs> They are absolutely awful. And then we're going to scan in the T-Rex again. And that way it's going to average out to something that is average as our team. But because the T-Rex is just so good in comparison to the Tijangasauruses, we should get an easy victory. Unless we're against a full team of aquatics. But let's see. So, that is my team. And let's see what we're against. We're all level 1. So, I'm expecting rares. Maybe really low super rares. Oh, no, no, I wouldn't have thought that even. Probably rares. Commons? Commons even? It could be commons even. Oh, it is commons. Even. We're against the Puffin! We're against the Puffin! So, oh god, no, this isn't good. We're against an amphibian last! So, uh, what I'm going to do here is the tactic that always seems to work, and that is reserve. Reserve, reserve, reserve. The T-Rex is the only creature here that actually is worth anything. And I want to showcase it. I want to win with it too. Ooh, two damage. Yeah, that's definitely going to kill us. Uh, one would have killed us, but thank God it went for two because now it's left open. And it, has, it hasn't it has reserved any turns. So again, we're going to reserve. And hopefully, Teox is going to kill Pelicanimus in a heartbeat. Uh, trope again. Tuki Tukan. Taken out. Now, uh, <laughs> Labyrinth. Um, yeah, that's sort of tricky. Uh, because it is our weakness. Teox's weakness. Wow, really? Really having to think hard. Really? Oh my god. What? Didn't go for anything? Are you kidding me? Oh wow, okay. Didn't go for anything. We might as well do two damage. I've only ever seen that happen once. An actual timeout. By a guy called Puffin. <laughs> it might be a real Puffin playing. Oh wow, okay. So now he's got three goes. We did some damage. Aha! There you go. So, we could switch in T-Rex. Um... 
Still, there's no point. We're going to try to do some more damage. Oh, four! Wow! Oh, must have went for three reserves. Tijong's doing actually a bit of damage. 2x can definitely kill that in one hit. Definitely. Hopefully, it goes for a lot of attacks over here. If it goes for seven, that's perfect, because then it has nothing left for block. However, if it doesn't, it go oh, it's got two left in block. Right, I'm going to have to be careful here. And there it is! Beautiful! Oh, wow! It's like somebody just got a paintbrush and put it on a T-Rex. I tell you what, it looks exactly like the Brawler Source. It's got shiny, pearly white teeth. Uh, lovely. Oh, I've, I'm on a timer. I'm on a timer. So, that's one. Factor in the two blocks. Factor in a possible two with the Labyrinth coming in. Yeah. So, I'm going to say that Tuki Toucan's going to come in. Here, there it goes, it comes in, and he's gonna know that Labyrinth is gonna have the advantage, so it's gonna waste a turn switching Labyrinth in. That's what I'm thinking. Because even if Labyrinth comes in, I don't think two hits of, from it can kill me. Yeah, even with the extra 50% boost if it goes to fall on four, which it, it doesn't, wow, okay. Um, ooh, I gotta play this, I gotta play this cool, guys, because he could have four blocks. Ah, oh, this isn't- Oh no. I mean, it's dead. Um, I gotta do this. I gotta do this. I gotta do this. Please don't have blocked. Oh yeah, we did it! It went for one block. Oh man. I could have put one extra in for a block there. It was one too much, I think. I think. So, Tuki comes in. Has six. Can only get three. Is it gonna go- If it goes for six- Oh no! No! Okay! Um, let me think. Three, like, 50... Well, it's 37, then 70, then 100. So we have to go 4-4. Four, four. We have to. We just have to. I don't think 4 can kill it. So as long as we... Oh, God! What's it gonna go for? Go for 8. Please, go for full-on 8. We will survive, and then we can kill it. Come on, go for 8. Go for 7! Oh, wait, for 8! Oh, wow! Is it gonna kill us? Oh, what? By four! By four! You big cheat! Ah! It will be 24 hours before this Brawlosaur can join your team again. Oh my god. Wow. Well, I guess that's gonna have to be it. 24 hours, jeez. Well, it looks like we can't do any more for like 24 hours, so. <laughs> I think that's gonna have to wrap up the video. A bit anticlimactic, I know. But we will be reviewing the Raptor, like, probably in the next episode. So if you've liked this video, leave a like again. Thank you for Dresser Collectible for uh, sending this to me. And hopefully, you'll go check out this video. See what it actually looks like in real life. Is it worth it? You've seen it now. In game, check it out as a product. So until next time, I'll see you later. Oh, bye bye.